because this is just like they play a disregard, disrespect for the teachers who sacrificed to make good changes in this country. At this point, it appears that the money is going to go through. Um, it, it appears that, uh, as Mr. Faber said uh, uh, last week, that he doesn't want to be engaged in any back and forth with anybody about this. He feels that they, that these um, peers that did not strike ought to be rewarded. This, to him, it doesn't seem yeah, to be well, anything against those who did go and strike. But yeah. these well, peers made their own sacrifice, if you will. That's how he's putting it. Yeah. My message to the minister or the deputy prime minister, if he's using his own personal funds, then I don't have a problem with that. But when he's using taxpayers' money, um, then I have a problem with that because at the end of the day, um, we are all taxpayers, we pay our taxes, and he cannot just take taxpayers' money and spend it how he feels like spending it. And it's a form of union busting. In any other place in this world, he would basically um, be out. And I think as a reason, we have a right to call him out for union busting. And this, this is blatant union busting, in our opinion.